Alright, hello again guys, and that's time for more idea of five. And in this episode we'll be making a nine digit combination lock, and this can be with any um combination and you can actually do nine or four. Anything that's really in a square is best. Um so we'll be building this and I actually have so this is basically like a number pad, so it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and I have that posted right here. Here's the code, I just made it 1 through 9 for um, demonstration, I'll go ahead and press that. And when we complete it, it will open this piston door over here. And I actually lag pretty bad. And you can press this pretty fast. Um, and these pressure plates will reset it. And I also have this button to reset it, so if we step on the pressure plate, sends the signal back, and also if we hit that button it will send the signal back. Basically it's actually quite simple, it's just this, which is the back side, and this is probably the only complicated part about it. Then you got your decoder, then um, RS NOR latches and AND gates, and you're done and then whatever you want to open with this. Here is a smaller 4 version which is just 4 numbers and 4 inputs and this one is 1, 2, 4, 3. That opens the door and I've actually got a reset button here. And so yeah that's what we'll be building today and this is a, another 4 block version but this is the show of how many different possibilities there are because this is eight different numbers and that's nine so yeah it's just one two one two alright so that's the key that we built something wrong alright I would not recommend this right here uh, forget this because in this you have to repeat numbers which for some reason is causing this to go on or off um so yeah we'll have to figure out why and yeah so we'll just be building the nine block combination I'm just gonna go ahead and forget about this cause this was a fail so go ahead and grab yourself some space I've been doing them all on this line just go ahead and place three, three, three blocks just like this. And of course, I'm failing pretty bad. And go ahead and put some buttons on them. And then put torches behind there. Now, if you see, if we press a button on this side, it affects torches on the other side. And that is going to be our key to doing this. Okay, so what you're going to do is go that one block and this is so that this torch doesn't affect it because if we put redstone see either one can power it so we'll just go like this and I actually need to um, check a reference this is probably the only reference I'll have to have the entire time because I need to see how far over you go so it's one two three four alright so you go five over um yeah, I probably should have remembered that, but I've only built this like four times. So, one, two, three, four, five, and then this will be redstone, and you'll bring it up right here, and this will be your repeaters that everything connects to. So, just a little hint, and um, for these, it's just straight across with redstone. Um, yeah. So now we will do these two on the sides, which would be, actually we haven't, yeah, alright, so we've completed the bottom row, so these are the bottom row here, here, and that one's over here, and you'll have to code this later based on what you want. Okay, so you'll place two blocks, repeater, repeater, redstone, and a repeater right there. And do the same over here. Alright, so we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
nine, and obviously we'll have to change that. And all right, so now we'll do this, which will be redstone, repeater, block, block, and then this will give us the ability to also do these, which will be redstone, redstone, block, 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 and redstone. And now you can see that all of these are lit. And now we have to do this top middle one, which is the oddest one. It kind of looks really, really ugly. Repeater there, redstone, then out, down, out, down, and then over. And just fill with redstone. And there you go. Now you should have one, two, three, four, five, six seven eight nine repeaters and that's it for this part so this is basically the way of getting it from here to into the decoder all right so now we'll stop using blue wool now you're going to want to dig two holes actually we will be adding um note blocks to the first part i believe so what you'll do is you'll just go like this and torches. This will give you some nice little music as you play. Um, if not, um, just if you don't want the music, which is what I did for these, go ahead and dig two blocks down. So right where this is and we'll get back to that later. Um, also, if you are building this, what I would recommend is that you uh, watch the whole video first and then start making it and then go back to the beginning of the video and as you watch it again, um, start uh, like following along with the video. We'll just go ahead and turn that up. So that will give you some music as you play. And if you do this, you're going to want to skip. Like, next you would have... Hold on, I'm just checking something here. Okay, so that would be how you would add it. And then you just add your repeaters and then you'd start your trench so um yeah that's how you would continue off of this and I'm going to take this down because I don't want to add the music because it is um a bit confusing sometimes um cause it you have to skip using the like RS Norlatch and all that for that one and it can get a bit confusing so yeah I'm gonna go ahead and break all these and hopefully I can do this in one video probably not so now you're gonna wanna dig the amount of trenches as you have numbers so we'll go one two three four five six seven eight nine trenches let me check time real quick. Okay, so we'll be wrapping this up. I believe I'm actually going to cut um, to when I've got all these dug out. And we'll start from there. So go ahead and dig out your trenches, just like this. If you're doing the nine, it will be nine. And I'm also going to show you right before we end the video how you would build the four. You would do the same thing but you would do just four blocks deep trenches and you would only do four little trenches so yeah alright I'll be back and I'll have all these dug out so goodbye uh, well, be sure and check out part two